What is happening, everybody? TC here with Smoky Mountain Knife Works, smkw.com. Today, top five traditional knife patterns. Number one might surprise you. Let's light it up. So today we're gonna be going over, and I've got way more than five knives on the table because TC math. But no, I wanted to show you different versions and different possibilities within these knife patterns. But we are gonna be going over the top five traditional knife patterns. Now, I had a lot of ways that I could attack this. And what I decided to do was, because we could go by, you know, what's been the most popular over the years, um, what's the most popular and most talked about online. But what I decided to do uh, is, I guess, the most provable one and go by our sales um, and the most popular patterns uh, so far this year. And so I looked at the ones that we had sold the most of this year and Yes, I said this was going to be top five. Number six is kind of an outlier. I included it simply because it has been really popular, but it's not one that is typically popular. And the reason being is that it is the Congress pattern. And that is the first one we're going to go over here. Um, now, we're going to show this one up close. This is the Case Small Congress. Of course, that is their vault pattern this year. And this one is the Campfire Bone Small Congress uh, SMKW exclusive right here. This is the four-blade version. They've also come out with uh, several two-blade versions as well. And the Congress was actually my favorite knife pattern um, as a kid because I was not good at sharpening knives. And so it was also always a very appealing pattern because you've got four blades, and I had four blades to get dull before I had to take it back to my dad and get him to sharpen it. So this has been an extremely popular pattern this year because it is Case's vault pattern. And um, I mean, they that's something that happens every year with the vault pattern. So this is kind of an outlier. That's why I included it as an honorable mention. Now, that's not the only kind of, uh, whoops. <laughs> That's not the only kind of Congress that we have. This is the small Congress. I've actually got an example right here of a normal size Congress, and this is in our Rough Rider Old Southwest series, and this is a beautiful, beautiful knife right here. Um, absolutely love this one. Got the reverse frost etching on the blade right there. Also a four blade pattern. Got the spear point, got the pin blade, got the sheep's foot right there two pin blades, excuse me, and absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous. So um, the Case Small Congress, in case you were wondering, that one's coming in at $69.99. The Rough Rider in the Old Southwest right here, that one's coming in at just $19.99. So that's number six on our top five. I know that doesn't make any sense whatsoever, but like I said, kind of an outlier because it's not usually one of the most popular patterns of traditional folding lives. And, and what I went by with that is... I went strictly with slip joints. I didn't do lockbacks because then you can get into a whole different realm and we're probably gonna do, um, I would say, I think that's a good idea. Let us know in the comments down below if you want us to do a top five lockback patterns. So that gives us another opportunity to go over some more knives. Next up on our list, and this is in the number five spot, and this is where a lot of people are gonna probably get upset because it's very interesting, and the top five was very, very close. But top five as far as popularity, actually the toothpick. I know a lot of you are like, what, really? Yes, top five is actually the toothpick pattern, and we've got a few different versions of the toothpick right here. This first one right here is the Case Smoky Valley Sunset Autumn Bone Medium Texas Toothpick. Now, the toothpick, can come in a large version, which is a little bit bigger than this one. I didn't actually bring one of those to show, um, but a large version is going to be, uh, you know, a little bit bigger than this one. Um, and this one's coming in with the 1095 carbon steel on the blade at just $69.99. Absolutely beautiful knife. I love the way that they didn't go with a shield on this one, and they went with the carbon 1095 stamp on the bolster right there. Now, we've also got some versions of the small toothpick. I've actually got the Queen City Abalone right here. And I've got the Case Genuine Stag small toothpick right here. 
Um, the abalone right here, that one's coming in at $24.99. This one is a phenomenal deal right here for genuine stag on that case, small toothpick with the collector's tin. And that one's coming in at $74.99. I said $24.99 on this one, $69.99 on the Autumn Valley Sunset. And that is number five on our traditional knife patterns right there. Coming in at number four, and this one is gonna, not going to be any surprise. It might be a surprise that it's not higher on the list. It kind of was to me. I figured it would be higher on the list. But number four on the list is actually a sod buster. Yes, this has been the classic work do-it-all knife for a very, very long time. And this first version to show off here, of course, is a case full-size Sodbuster right there, and that's with the black composition handles, smooth composition handles, um, coming in with a true sharp surgical steel on the blade, and of course it's got the Sodbuster etching on the blade right there with the plow, and this is going to be an eight dot tang pattern, and this one's coming in at just thirty seven ninety nine. Great deal right there for a really good all-around work knife. Now, there are several different versions and you can pick up a Sodbuster in a lot of different brands. Another really interesting one here that we've got to show off is actually an eye brand, Carl Schlipner. And this is going to be, of course, since it's, since it's not a case, this one is actually a Clodbuster. Yeah, see what they did there? Yeah. And uh, this is a really great knife too, coming in at $46.99. Um, and that one is uh, made in Soligen, Germany. It's got Germany right there on the tang right there. Carl Schleppner right there on the blade as well. And we've got several different colors of these. I picked this one out because I think it really pops and I like the color. I think it looks really cool. But again, another really great uh, work knife pattern. This one is going to be more of like a junior pattern. Um, so you can see the size difference there between the full size Sodbuster and of course, Case also has the Sodbuster Jr. and then the Clodbuster Jr. here. So really great work knives right there. And that's coming in at number four on our traditional knife patterns list. And like I said, this is purely based on sales and, and what we've sold so far this year. Coming in at number three, and this one's another kind of surprise. I thought this one would be a little bit higher. I thought this one might be second on the list. However, it's coming in at number three. And that of course is the ever popular Barlow. This is a classic knife pattern that dates back over a, well over a hundred years. And let's take a look at this one. Now this one right here is a really beautiful version right here. And this is the last one that we actually had in our showroom. Now we do have these in stock uh, in our warehouse. We'll be getting more of these in our showroom. But this is a beautiful, beautiful knife right here coming from Boker. And this is an SMKW exclusive and a smoking hot deal online right now. Coming in at $99.99. So on this one, we're talking 01 tool steel on the blades. We're talking copper bolsters, copper liners right there, copper pins, and really nice smooth brown burlap micarta on the handles. And that beautiful stonewash finish on the blade. Like I said, this one's marked down from $145.99 to $99.99 and a great deal right there and a beautiful, beautiful knife. Now, this is a single bladed version of a Barlow. So I wanted to show off a couple of different versions. So that's that's the, the typical main size of a Barlow. Now you can also, I guess more popularly, it's going to be a two bladed Barlow. And that's what you're going to see actually more often is going to be a two bladed version. So same size, but a two blade, you're going to have the clip point and the pin blade right there. And then one that has been extremely popular is the granddaddy Barlow. So obviously going to be a good bit larger right there. And typically you're going to see just a single blade in the granddaddy Barlow right there. And this is in our Rough Rider Buckshot Bone series. Um, beautiful knife with the buckshot bone on the handles. You've got the red G10 liners right there, which are absolutely gorgeous. And one of my favorite series that we have. I love those handles. They feel great in the hand. Super comfy. Um, so the Stoneworks version here coming in at $19.99. Uh, again, the Boker Copper one coming in at $99.99 and the Buckshot Bone coming in at just $16.99 on that Granddaddy Barlow. And that is number three on our traditional knife patterns list. Now, 
Number two. Can you guess what they are? Can you guess what the last two are going to be? Number two on the list is actually what I thought would be number one, and that's a trapper pattern. Now, within the trapper pattern, you can have several different versions. I didn't bring all of them up here to show on video. Um, you can have a slimline trapper. You can have a mini trapper. You can have a trapper. You can have a big boy trapper. Um, and actually, that's been one of the most popular ones lately, and that is going to be our new Queen USA made big boy trapper. Let's take a look at that one right there. So this one is the Queen Burnt Bone Big Boy Trapper folding knife right there. Coming in with 1095 carbon steel on those blades right there. Got the typical main blade and then spay blade. And this is a big boy right there. Got the burnt saw cut bone on the handles right there. Beautiful, beautiful knife coming in at just $57.99. $57.99 is a smoking hot deal for a USA made 1095 carbon steel blade trapper right there with the queen name on it. Absolutely excited to be able to bring that brand back stateside and um, it, it's, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous knife. Now, um, also within this realm is going to be a, a couple of others and I wanted to show those off. So, like I said before, you can have several different versions of a trapper. I'm going to set that one right there. We've also got the regular trapper pattern, and this is going to be in our olive green Crandall jigged bone exclusive from Case right there. And you can see the size difference. So you can see that, you know, the big boy here is, is a decent amount bigger than the traditional trapper size right here that we see on the Case. And then uh, this one's coming in with their True Sharp Surgical Steel on the blades. You've got the traditional clip point right there and the spay blade right there. And then we've also got a mini trapper in that same handle material. And that's going to be a beautiful version as well, coming in with half stops. And so those are coming in at $58.99 and $61.99 respectively. And of course, $57.99 for the queen right there. Beautiful patterns. And of course... Trappers are going to be one of the most popular versions out there, period. Now, I know you're saying, if the trapper is number two, and you've already gone through the Barlow, you've already gone through the toothpick, the Congress, what could possibly be number one on the list? Now, I know some of you right there are saying, maybe it's a Stockman. No, Stockman did not make the list at all even though they are insanely popular. It is not a Stockman. You give up? What, what do you think it is in the comments? Go ahead and write, pause the video, write it in the comments. Let me know what you think it is. Number one slot, it's gonna be a Camp King pattern. Yes, I know, that's insane. But, there's a reason for it, all right? So the first Camp King pattern that I'm going to show you is actually in our Rough Rider line. This is the Cinnamon Bone Stag version right here, coming in with carbon blades. And I absolutely love this knife. This is going to be, um, I guess, if you, if you go back, uh, what I would say is going to be one of the original multi-tools right here. Um, now, of course, Victorinox goes back to the 1800s with their original model, but uh, as far as, you know, what we consider something that is multi-use and versatile, the Camp King has been, well, king for a really, really long time and used um, extensively throughout our history, not only um, by civilians, but also by the military. And I'm going to show you an example of that here in just a minute, but this is the Cinnamon Bone Stag version of the Camp King right there, coming in in 1999. Of course, you've got the bottle opener right here, the flathead screwdriver or pry bar. You've got the uh, awl right there or reamer. You've got the can opener right here, and you've got the main blade right here, and then, of course, the bale. That one's coming in in 1999. And again, carbon steel on those blades. I know a lot of people really dig that. I do. And, of, of course, beautiful stag bone handles right there, uh, which are Gorgeous, and a great deal on that one. Now, speaking of great deals, and this is why this one made the list, because of our sales, is going to be our Marbles 
GI utility knife right here. This is kind of uh, not necessarily the original Camp King. Of course, the original Camp King had the synthetic handles um, made by several different companies, including most notably Camillus. But this one is going to be a phenomenal version and at an insane price. And it works so well. This is one of my favorite knives that we have, especially as far as um, being a great deal. And that is going to be our Marvel's USGI utility knife. Let's take a look at that one right there. So this uh, is a version of the knife that we recreated um, that is basically a copy. And I wish I would have brought an brought my dad's version in that he was actually issued when he was in the military. I've actually got it. It was made by Camillus, um, but this is almost an exact copy of that one. So again, you've got the bottle opener, flathead screwdriver, you've got the all reamer, you've got the can opener right there, and you've got the main blade, of course, with the bail, and then you've got the stainless steel um, handles, and just a really really great versatile knife a great camping knife great pack knife and the cool thing about this one is it's only $6.99 that is a smoking hot deal and that is why this one continues to be and make the list of our top five because of how many of these we sell because it is such a great deal and they work so phenomenally well so i know you didn't see that coming camp king number one in the traditional folders list I know that's a surprise. So recapping, we've got the Congress, we've got the Toothpick, we've got the Sodbuster, we've got the Barlow, we've got the Trapper, and we've got the Camp King. Let us know what you think should have made the list. Maybe you wish a Stockman was on the list. Maybe you like the Peanut better. There's a lot of different traditional patterns out there, and we're going to go over all of them at some point. These are the top five as far as sales goes in our store. Let us know what you think about that in the comments down below. As always, folks, it's been me, TC, here with Smoky Mountain Knife Works, smkw.com. And remember, if it cuts like a traditional slip joint knife, then we carry it. Hi.